What's going on? We got that forensics report on the broken headlight on Miguel's car. And it matched up with the broken glass that we found at the hit and run site. Well, there you have it, folks. I knew it was Miguel who ran Fox down in cold blood. No. Look, I had no choice but to place you under arrest for the attempted murder of Fox Crane. I can't believe this, Sam. I didn't do it. Do you understand these rights as I've just explained it? Yes, I do. I'm so sorry, Mia. It's not your fault, Paloma. Your boss is just doing his job. But I didn't do this, I swear. I believe you. The evidence says you did. I don't care what the evidence says, and I could care less what you think. I just don't want for one second for Kay or my sister to think that I would resort to something so low down and vicious. Kay, please tell me you don't think I did this. Kay, look at me. I swear I didn't do this. Go oh, forget it, Miguel. Kay doesn't believe you, and neither will anyone else. Let's go. But I swear I didn't do this, Kay. Come on. It's gonna be okay. How? How is this ever gonna be okay? I'm in love with two men. God, one of them could die any minute, and the other may spend the rest of his life in jail for his murder. In here, Miguel. At least I was able to put you across from your brother. Luis, what the hell are you doing in here? Never mind me. What the hell are you doing here? I've been charged with Fox's hit and run, but I didn't do it. Sam, what the hell is going on here? Look, I'm sorry, Luis, but the forensics report matched up your brother's car headlights with the glass found at the accident scene. Only I wasn't driving it, okay? I, I don't understand any of this. Luis, what are you doing here? Oh, uh, Sam didn't tell you. I'm sorry, well, but uh, I had to do what I had to do. I've been charged with, uh, with rape. Fancy cranes rape. But that's crazy! There has to be some mistake here. Yeah, well, Nancy was attacked again last night, and uh, the hospital test results show that I matched the attacker's DNA. Oh, my God. Only I didn't do it. Fancy and I have never even made love. But, uh, enough about me. How are you doing, Miguel? You have a lawyer yet? No, I'm broke. I'm gonna have to hire a public defendant. Miguel, hey, don't worry about it. I'll take your case, all right? I can't pay you, Ethan. It's all right. We'll work something out. Thank you. Sure. Do me a favor. Is it something I can do to help prove your innocence? Oh, can you go and check in on Fancy for me? Yeah. Sure. Mama's gonna handle this. Yeah, I know. Both the Lopez Fitzgerald brothers arrested at the same time, <clears throat> and the evidence against them is mounting. I'm a good lawyer, Dad, but uh, I'm not sure I can get either one of them off the hook. I'm gonna do my best to see about bail. So try to hang in there, all right? Both of you. You know where to find us. thinking about what this is going to do to Mama. She knows that we shouldn't be in here. You believe me, right? You know I didn't run down Fox in my car. I know. So how did the shards from a broken headlight end up at the accident site? You were asking the wrong guy. I don't even know how my semen got into fancy. She doesn't think he raped her, does she? I don't know. I don't know what the hell to believe anymore. You didn't rape her, okay? Yeah. All I know is the, uh, the evidence is pretty damning. Yeah, well, so is mine. I mean, it's weird, isn't it? What a coincidence that both of us wind up here at the same time, being charged for crimes neither one of us committed. With physical evidence pointing directly at us. Like someone's got it in for the Lopez Fitzgerald brothers. Read my mind, little brother. Read my mind. But who, Luis?
I mean, who hates that much to want to destroy our lives? And why? 